I'm very happy to welcome Mark Buckridge into the Soundfeed studio. Thanks Thank for coming into us, Mark. Yeah. Um, and you just performed a, um, a live version of the title track from your recent album, Coastal Sunshine, which we'll talk about soon. Mm. But um, I just wanted to kind of ask you about, um, you, I suppose, first uh, put your music on online for the for people to hear back in way back in 2012 with a, with a, an EP yeah, and, yeah. you know Rai Smile tells it all you're yeah, like oh yeah. god what was I doing back yeah, then yeah. which is actually really good I've listened yeah, to yeah. it um, but it was kind of around I suppose um, 2014 then you, you brought out uh, the second EP yeah. um, and uh, which was which was great uh, really strange uh, yeah, yeah. Well, well it was but yeah. it, it was it was um um, I can talk to you, and yeah, yeah. and it was uh, like a, a five tracks, but they're they're, they're all quite different. But it, mm. it did have that kind of very kind of lo-fi kind of um, DIY feel, yeah, which, yeah, yeah. Which, which you have done with, yeah. with all of your your releases. Yeah, yeah. they're all self produced. And, yeah. um, and then so long the single came out yeah. with a, another <laughs> with a great of, great video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A friend video there. Yeah, uh, down down the countryside. Was that yeah. in your in your hometown? Or no, no, my friend Rory Mullen. Shout out to Rory. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He videoed it in his uh, grandfather's house. Yeah, yeah, it was great. And uh, we spent out for the day and had a bit of crack. Good stuff. And and the 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 two of them came out relatively. I mean, I suppose there was a year maybe between the two of them. Yeah. But that did kind of. I suppose start a little bit of a flutter around, like uh, you know, the the music scene, as mm. as the people say. Yeah. Uh, we need to work on our synonyms. Um, but, yeah. um, how how did you uh kind of re- find the reaction? I I kind of get the impression that you're probably the type of person who likes to just kind of bring the music out, <laughs> leave it there, and see what happens. Kind yeah, of yeah. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's so long. Like uh, there was a conscious effort to make a, a popular two minute song so mm. I was looking looking a lot of 50s music like um, yeah. studying that like um, Al, Al Martino mm. was the first uh, number one in 1958 he did a song and uh, yeah I just started looking at that and I just wanted to try my hand at pop music because yeah. my stuff before that was very um, not obscure but it was very there was no structure to mm. it and there was uh, time signatures and that were not in time and there was instruments not in tune or there was things falling over which was yeah. kind of endearing in a way yeah but, yeah uh i wanted to constantly stru- structure myself in that uh avenue to give yeah. it a go so i kind of started with that and then i was working a lot of art stuff and then i kind of wanted to take a break from music for a while so yeah. i took about a year yeah uh, i wrote music for a choir got commissioned to write music for choir so i mm-hmm. did that and then i just had to do this like yeah. and uh I always wanted to do an album and uh, I was going to say yeah, there, was, there was no there was a there was quite like uh, like so long did create quite a stir you, mm. you were on a lot of the big websites you yeah. know um, and uh, it went down really well mm. but then there was that gap of uh, between that was uh, in 2015 yeah and, and it was only one song it wasn't yeah like, it doesn't <laughs> take like one you know, one song doesn't take that long, but an album like is a yeah, big thing. Yeah, exactly. So uh, I was yeah. that that was what I was going to ask that, mm. that you were starting to explain there. There was a bit of a gap between that and and the yeah. Coast of Sun- Sunshine album yeah, just yeah. came out this summer. Yeah. Um. You 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 felt basically you needed to kind of take a bit of a breather from it. Yeah. yeah. Well, I I suppose like yeah, with the music for choir and I did a solo show on on seven huge paintings I did in Dublin. Yeah. And uh, I was working a lot in the art world and uh, I wanted to go back to something really pure, simple, mm. direct and it didn't need to have a reason. It was just pure, like a feeling that you like the, so- the sound of it or yeah, you, know, yeah. you just like, like the way it feels. Or So when I was making it, it was very back to your basics, uh, mm-hmm. like of just liking the way a drum beat is or liking the way a certain chord progression is and not explaining it to yourself. And yeah. then once you do the melody and that then it was down to the towards the lyrics and yeah then that's a heavy burden when you put lyrics in yeah. and there's a lot of uh, connotations with that so um but i love it's it's just such a great medium to work in because yeah. it's something everyone can get like everyone can get popular music and it's just so such a hit like yeah, yeah. like you can remember a time when you listen to a certain song and it reminds you of something and yeah. it's just what other art form can do that like yeah it's yeah and what you're rare. doing and yeah you're at the time and everything. You're with. yeah so and and the like the coastal sunshine i suppose it, it like 
it was quite different to what you've done before with, with little kind of traces of it but you have the album here um and it's also um the the sleeve is uh the 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 jacket that's come in is do you want to tell us about that um there's not much to tell really it's yeah. just a it's just a chip bag very cheap to get <laughs> yeah. um functional blue, blue marker yeah the yeah. blue marker it's very functional cheap serves a purpose yeah it's a sleeve and yeah it's it's like uh, with the DIY and lo-fi people call it that but yeah. in a sense like if I had loads of money I would make really lush a uh, wall of sound recordings of Beach Boys yeah. uh, so it's out of necessity really yeah. that I work in the context of like uh, do you know recording myself like I'd love to have this epic producer but yeah. I don't think he wants me <laughs> yeah 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 and you'd love to have really expensive but chip bags you would, you would. Uh, yeah and I would yeah. but then would that be me? I don't know. So yeah, exactly. Yeah. And uh, and and the uh, I I did notice as well the album that you kind of um it got quite uh, um as the album went on mm. it got you you did have kind of some strong electronic kind of uh, yeah. uh sounds in it. It was a very yeah. theatrical album as well. Mm. Um, is there was there is there anybody I suppose uh, like among your peers who are who are uh, um involved in Irish music at the moment to do electronic music that particularly kind of float your boat. Uh, no. At all, no. Just no, I, I don't. I to be honest, I don't listen to anyone really. I yeah. don't. I am not really one for l listening to music. I, I, I like I have loads of records and stuff, but yeah, I just yeah. do your like, own thing. I do my own loads, thing. I love yeah. the making process, but like I love bands like Suicide and like like yeah. a lot of oh, like just really aggressive. Uh, pull at your hearts kind of music. Yeah, that's yeah. like really aggressive, but like mm. I don't really. I you know. I like gardening and do other things like I don't yeah, yeah, I don't yeah, spend yeah. my time listening to records. And you have the you have the art pieces here well, like the, they're, featuring some of the videos. Yeah, like the it, like I suppose they're quite funny and all, but like yeah. basically they're in a way they're a catalyst and wire, right? That wrote the album I got like in a way it's just like a foot like in sandals, yeah. but like it's handmade and the album yeah. is handmade, but like yeah. um really I was making these sculptures before I made the album mm -hmm. and uh like they were catalysts for starting the album yeah. and uh they're part of it the yeah way. and they relate a lot to way i think like and in, in 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 a sense that i think the idea is the most important whether it's skillfully made or yeah. if it's not it's about uh making Different. something that's original and maybe def like not in great condition or anything oh, well, that's, that's all <laughs> but like is, yeah you know, how, yeah. how people receive. yeah and mark people uh want to kind of um, get their copies of Coastal Sunshine. Mm. You're on Bandcamp. Um, you also have uh, website. a wonderful website, yeah. uh, markbookers. dot com. I'm on shop. You can buy drawings, yeah, CDs, drawing CDs, the whole things, work, and um, paintings, yeah. sculptures, <laughs> sculptures, sculptures, yeah, everything, balls, um, uh, multi packs of chip bags. I wouldn't uh, eat that you know, in this yeah. ball though. <laughs> no, um, it's been around. It'd be toxic. I'd say. Yeah. But Mark, thank you once again so much for coming in. No I really appreciate it and we're looking forward to sharing the video for Perfect, thanks, Sunshine. Jamie. Thanks so much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Very good.